Turns out he was holding a flashlight. At 525, an emotional reunion between a Houston family and some of Houston's bravest. Last month, firefighters saved the mother and her two small children from their burning home. And yesterday, the family made a special trip to the firehouse to say thank mm -hmm. you. Jennifer's in now with the story. Boy, was it emotional. I had to just hold back and and think, wow, this is crazy. Well, it was emotional. The mom hugged the firefighters and she was in tears talking about everything that she remembered. It's a real blessing to be standing here because they really saved us, they saved us. The Smith family is thanking the firefighters they call heroes. They visited Station 19 to meet the firefighters that answered their call for help on February 11th. My daughter came in my room. She was like, it's smoking, Mommy, it's smoking. That is when Shanae discovered her house was on fire. The space heater had caught on fire, and it was like flames. To the ceiling. In a matter of minutes, help was on the scene, but firefighters' hopes weren't so high. Shanae and two of her youngest children were trapped inside. Firefighters didn't think the Smith family would make it out of this smoke-filled house alive, but tried desperately to rescue them. The smoke started coming up. I could see a little bit more, and I saw two little feet sticking up in the air. And I knew we had another one, so my priority went to the child. One by one, Shanae and her children were carried out of their burning home. It's a rare instance that we come across people inside a building that are unconscious. We remove them, and they're successfully revived. It's a rare thing. So this was a very good day for not only the Smith family, but for us. One of the best feelings I've ever had. I, I thought they were, I didn't think they were a... Uh, uh, Bible victims. The Smith family wants our entire community to know they're here because of the work done by these brave firefighters. Coming in the house with flames everywhere, I'm, you know, they're very brave because not everybody, you know, can do what they do. The family spent several days in the hospital in critical condition. Under the hot button at clicktohouston.com, you can find out how to get out alive if there's a fire in your home. Time now is 527. Local 2 Investigates has